So it's time to talk a little more about some 3D printing stuff because that's what I got going on right now. I've been doing a lot of printing for Guillaume again and I just finished up. So I want to show you the latest pieces. Greetings, Dave here. DCPFX, a little bit different in front of the, front of the computer again. It's got uh, the on-air sign going. I want to talk about uh, some more 3D printing I've done for Guillaume because I seem to be doing a lot for him these days. He actually sent me a very nice message on Facebook the other day saying, thank you. Thank you very much for all the work you're doing. And you know, I hope I'm not being a pain. And he's not. He's not. This is a job, right? So I've been hired to do this. So I'm, I'm very happy to do it. Let me show you some of the stuff I've got done, uh, mainly the trans dagger from Power Rangers Lost Galaxy. So here is the, right here, this is the trans dagger. Over here is the, uh, the quasar saber. So. No, there's the right there. But um, I want to talk about the trans dagger. So there's a lot of different pieces here. So this comes out of here. And this is another piece that goes in. And it just sits like that. And all these pieces here, this is, this is one side. This goes in the middle. This is the other one. So I'm, I really, I have no idea how this goes together. Other than the fact, I think that goes in there. And that, I believe, goes in there, and that will link here somehow. I don't know. I don't have the actual file. I don't have it. Guillaume just sent me pieces here, print these for me. I don't know what goes where and how and if. And I'm just guessing that that, and then this goes in here somewhere. And uh, these are caps that go on, and this goes on probably either here or here, I would assume, just from the size. I assume they go something like that. But I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I, I haven't watched Lock Galaxy in so long, I really don't have any idea. But this is just a lot of little bits. And it's just, it's a fun print, but it just takes forever. This piece here was 19 hours. And that was at you know, 20% infill. And then these are the pieces. So this is about a week's worth of printing. I'll take this back up top. So this is just something I, I do, you know, uh, if you have files you want me to print, obviously, you know, get in touch with me. Uh, you can just email me at info at tcpfx.com or, you know, message me here or find me on Facebook. Uh, I do this for people because a lot of people just don't have printers. They don't have the ability to or access to it or they have access to it, but it's like at a library and they can't do a, well, what is this in total? This was a, it's a week, it's a week. Um, this piece here for the, uh, tr the Lost Galaxy Quasar server was 38 hours, 40 hours, something like that. It was, it was a long time. And, you know, it, you can't do things like that at a library, unfortunately. You just can't do that. They, they won't let you. Uh, I think libraries and, and, you know, makerspace like that are great to get you to try it, to see if it's something for you, and then you will go down that path and it will look into your own printer. So that is something I've just finished up. Obviously, I need to now get it to Guillaume, and it needs a little bit of TLC, like some uh, some spots like right here, just because you know that's down on the bed. It needs a little bit of sanding. Same with some of the some of the lines in here needs a little bit of sanding. But that's for Guillaume to finish. I just do the the main product and let him do the rest. So that, in a nutshell, is an update on the Trans Dagger from Power Rangers Lost Galaxy, a file I did for a client. So there you go. Hope everyone out there has having a great day. I hope you're enjoying this, this lovely weather. Of course, at this point now that you're re reviewing this, the lovely weather is gone. Uh, up here in Canada, the last couple of days has been, well, June in April. And it's funny, I look back at some old posts, and five years ago, it was a, a terrible storm where I was coming back from North Bay, and I couldn't see where the car was supposed to go. Uh, it was very surreal. It was a huge storm that came through this area, and... It was like walking dead sort of thing. There was nobody. There was nobody in front of me. There was no one behind me. And on the other lane of the highway, I barely saw, I saw one person in an hour because like, why am I doing this? Oh yeah, I don't live in North Bay. So anyway, it's, it's funny seeing that because five years later, it's 30, well not 30, I guess 28 degrees, 28, 26 degrees, an insane, insane day. But that's just me. Hope everyone enjoyed the nice warm weather, a little bit of precursor to summer coming. And uh, hey, I'll talk to you all later.